It's hard to tell in the candlelight, but the backdrop of this vigil is a prison in Norwalk, California. That's where inmates, among many dozens in prisons across the state, are on a nearly two-month-long hunger strike to protest their solitary confinement. Now, their families are speaking up. Right now, under federal government law, research chimpanzees are protected from being held in solitary confinement because they're defined as social beings and that it's detrimental to their mental and physical health. So how much more of a social being is my son or is you know, my friend's husband or somebody else's son? I mean, a human being is the most social being that there is. I'm not going to let my son die. The inmates want prisons to stop housing them in near isolation for years on end, simply because they're associated with gangs. There's no reason why they should be held in a cage 23 hours out of the day. I haven't held my son in 10 years. I haven't been able to touch him. And this has to stop. I won't lose my son. I will not lose my son. So right now, as we State officials argue solitary confinement helps keep prison gangs in check. But on Friday, a United Nations expert said the practice in the U.S. can amount to torture.